All right, so let's talk about the second commandment of concealed carry, and that is, if you're gonna carry, be prepared to use your gun, all right? Um, be ready. A lot of times, um, even just, if you get into a self-defense situation, sometimes even just drawing your gun will stop the threat, because a lot of times the criminal is not prepared for you to have a gun. So sometimes, a lot of times, not saying it's gonna happen, but sometimes, just draw it, but you just can't draw it and not be ready to use it because if you draw it, you need to be ready to, to go. So, main things to remember is that criminals don't fear guns. A lot of times they arm themselves, you know, they're around guns all the day. What they do fear is that person is going to point a gun back at them. Yeah, that, that's what they're scared of. It's an irony in, in, in the gun and uh, defensive self situations that most of the time the people that, um, are prepared, that learn, that know how to use a gun in self-defense, rarely have to. It's usually the people that, that don't, that get into these situations. That's because criminals, they're, 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 they can a little smart, but they know what to look for. They're looking for weak, they're looking for opportunity, people that's not paying attention, they're paying attention to body language, people that are paying attention to them. They're paying attention to that stuff. So, so that's how they're picking their victim. Most of the time, if you're somebody that is prepared, um, that knows about concealed carry, that knows about defensive gun use, you're going to give off vibes to them that they're not going to mess with you. They're going to look for another victim. So that's why a lot of times, people that are ready, people that are just ready to go, never get into those type situations. The main thing is that if you are, you've been training, you get ready, and that situation comes, Will you be ready? Will you pull your gun? Are you prepared to stop the threat? If stopping the threat means taking a life, cause that is quite possibly what, what, what may happen. So just kind of get that wrapping around your brain. Um, if you carry, be prepared to use your weapon. If you're hesitant, you may die. Others around you may die, get hurt. So just, just don't let the criminal take, if you pull, don't let them take your gun. If you pull it, be prepared to use it. If you got to use it, use it to stop the threat. We're not using the wound. We're not trying to kill. You're trying to stop the threat. So if you um, carry your gun, be prepared to use your gun. Command, that is commandment. That is commandment uh, number two. Um, if you carry your gun, be prepared to use your gun.